We saw to our chain to respond to their owner's hand signals and spoken signals. This is Corporal Gary D'Souza of the South San Francisco Police Department and his dog Ice. His dog Ice was recently retired. one in the slit you see where the slobber is because they'll yeah. put their nose on there's one in that slit of that chair and then um, there's one in this top drawer right here and stand that's, by that's marijuana the police department planted real drugs in this room to, uh, for the dogs to find once the dog finds the the drugs they start scratching at that place and after that they're rewarded with a toy Along as being taught how to sniff out drugs, these dogs are taught how to apprehend criminals and protect their officers. surrenders it's called a recall what they're supposed to do is supposed to stop and come back to us okay she hasn't done it in a while she's retired so heal surrender us in the dog no. heal yeah stay surrender us in the dog no surrender us in the dog do that These dogs may seem very scary and aggressive out in the field, but at home they are very calm and loving dogs.
After seeing the police dogs attack, I want to see firsthand how strong they can bite. And then stand still, and then he'll call her back to you. Uh, when she's coming at the bike, and then if she comes, like say she comes on the bike, she's circling around here. Just your whole, all your time, pull the sleeve out here, okay? Uh, yeah, then if you start dancing around with her, then she's gonna come in, and you know, it might bite you if you sit it here, you know. Uh, but she's, I'll, arm, I'll she'll, she'll, she'll bite you here. In front uh, of your body. Make sure your legs start out before your your arm hits. Yeah, stand like in a position where you can catch her. It's, it's gonna be a little impact, not a big one. Hold it down like, like this. So there, there you go. There.